Today, me and Club Secretary Ryan's up here in the North Hills of Georgia. Thought we'd stop by this Piggly Wiggly. Go in here and check out this market manager. He's one of our club members. So let's get on in there and check him out. Club members, we're up here in Marble Hill, Georgia. This here is supposed to be, from what I hear, the biggest IGA in the state of Georgia. We're going to go in here and meet these meat cutters. These guys here, I don't know. We're not going to take up too much of their time because they really look like they're busy here today. Let's go on here and see if we might get to say hello to one or two of them. All right, we're on. Hey, club members, we're down here at what? Walking Blades. Walking Blades. Y'all know me, sometimes I can't even pronounce the name right. This here, Mr. Joey. He's the meat man here. Joey, tell them about your meat case and what y'all do. Uh, we got our chickens. We start with chicken over here. We got a locally grown chicken. You sell any organic? Or? Yeah, we do sell organic. It'll be on down. The chicken's organic. Uh, we sell cold smoke chops. They uh, smoke to 80 degrees. And they're not fully cooked. Where do they come from? Uh, we get them from cock meats. Cock meats. And uh, then we got our corn. We make all of our sausages here. Case them. Well, I noticed that sausage when I first stepped up here. I, I like that. My wife's pretty though, that sausage. If she was here, I'd have to be spending money. Oh, yeah. We, we make all of our sausage. Then we got uh, natural free bacon, all natural bacon. Then we got our thick cut bacon and our pepper bacon. Then we got all beef hot dogs. We dry each our own meat here for 28 days before we cut it. We got dry eats, ribeyes. Uh, you got some good looking red meat there. Yeah, and then we got our bacon steak burger. It's a uh, 7% steak trimming, 30% of our bacon ground together. Sound like a winner. Then we got our prime New York strips, and we got prime fillets. Sometimes we bring in prime ribeyes, uh, prime cowboys. We bring a lot of prime stuff in. Then our chuck roast, our rump roast, the peep steak, London broil. How long y'all been open here? We've been open three years here. Three years? Yes, sir. Well, sir, if you made it three years, I know you're doing good business. And then we got our stew beef. We cut it out of our London broils and stuff. We got our top sirloin, our bone-in ribeyes, 
and we'll have bacon wrap fillets, and we'll have regular fillets, Angus choice fillets, and then we've got New York strips. You see, that's your seafood counter down there, too. Yes, sir. Hey, take a quick shot of that whole market right there, Mr. Right? And then we'll go down here to the seafood case and check him out. We'll get all of our seafood in from the Gulf. We'll make a ground scaly. How far to go to the The Gulf is Mobile or? Yeah, all over. They run up all way. I was born in Mobile. Yeah, we got eight, eight different boats that you travel up down the East Coast. These are locally grown grass-fed beef. Now, who do you get your grass-fed from? Uh, Southeast Family Farms They're in Alabama. It's right over the line. It's all grass-fed. We have we do stuffed chickens, which we ain't got no stuffed chickens out right now. And then our seafood, we have... Apalachicola. Yeah, we have flounder, Apalachicola. We get crawfish in from Louisiana. And I'm going to tell you, I got, I got a brother. He's known as the meat pill in the site. I could bring him over here and I guarantee you we can eat him faster than you can show him. Ah, you probably can, because they're paying to show him. Mr. Ryan, turn around and let the club members see the rest of this store. That's a nice story. Hey, I like the barbecue over in the corner, too. Yeah, we got a full-blown deli. We can cook anything we do. Do you remember the old Barbecue King uh, group histories they used to have years ago that started most of all the time? Uh, this, I may not. That, uh, Barbecue sauce they put out. Madison and fish here. Yeah. Well, Mr. Ryan, I guess we better get on out of here and let the man get back to work. Uh, I appreciate y'all coming hey, in. Yeah, man. Hey, down here at that block and blade, Miss Patty back there took and give me a sandwich here. Don't know what the name of it is, but I tell you one thing, this thing is good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Hey club members, we're down here at Memphis Meat Market. This is wine, right? Yes. I done got lost out of this. Wine to Georgia all the way. This here is Joe Rill. He's a good he's a market manager though. I'm the owner. He's the owner. And he's a really cool. No, uh, that's Billy. But Billy doesn't work here, right? It's uh, my store manager is Mark. Hey, get a little picture of this case here. He sells that good stuff down here. He's a natural man. Joe, what all do you sell down here? Creekside Farms only? or? No, we sell uh, CAB, Certified Angus Beef by Genetics. With DNA trace back. We carry the Springer Mountain chicken. We carry the Royal Reds. These are down so deep they never see the light of day. They're down at least 1,200 feet. They come off the Florida Keys. And then all our fish is wild caught. Um, and it's flown into us from the dock. FedEx into a land and trucked to us within 24 hours of being caught. Oh, wow. We don't carry, we don't, we don't get anything outside the U.S. Oh, uh, Lawrence over there. Mr. Lawrence. Yes, sir. How many years you been in this business? Is it, is it that many that you can't count them up now? Uh, we've been over this for 10 years. Who'd you start with? Oh, uh, Brad from Beasley down there in the Athens. Who'd you start with, Jeff? Oh, my goodness. I started with the little mom and pop shop back in New Jersey. Uh, and it was called Save Right. Nothing to do with the wind dixie. It's just a little mom and pop thing. You ever cross A and P's uh A P, Grand Union? No, I'm a little uh, A and P man. Uh, That's where <laughs> I spend most of my time at. And I've worked with uh, Bruno, Engel, 
Publix, Win Dixie. I've been with Win Dixie too. Uh, and then uh, I also worked with uh, Del Hay, Food Lion, the Blooms, Harvey's, and Sweet Days. I need to talk to you later about them parties. <laughs> Go ahead and finish that case up there. We don't want to hold these folks up from working too much. And you notice all our beef is black agate. Our specialty are these three right here. You can't get that in the grocery store because they're made from the Terrace Major muscle. Terrace Major muscle is a muscle under the shoulder of the calf. It gets hardly any exercise. And if you Google it, T-E-R-E-S, Major, you'll find that it's the second most tender piece of meat on the calf. Huh. You and make we, your own sausage too, Joe? Yes. And, and we, this is like, you can cut this with a spoon, a baby spoon, it's okay. And then our, our ground chuck we do here from chuck shoulder clots. And our chuck is 90 to 95% lean. <laughs> our sirloin, we, we take the caps off our top sirloins and we use those plus the whole sirloin if we need to. It's almost a trap tip. between 97 and 99% lean. I'm Italian and I've got my own blend of meatloaf and uh, it's used with brown sirloin. Uh, crushed tomatoes is my blend of seasoning. I even have uh, Parmesan cheese. In a 35 pound pan, it only gets a cup and a half of breadcrumb. Huh. Our hot dogs is all Black Angus beef certified. No fillers. The only thing in those hot dogs are sea salt and celery. We carry the old fashioned hickory smoked bacon. The applewood nitrate free. Our breakfast sausage, don't look for grease because you're lucky if you get a beat or two. Huh. We make it strictly from the center cut moments pork points. And then we have our alligator sausage and we use the sirloin meat, not not the alligator tail. And then we have our pine sausage, crop work. It's made here. I have my own recipe and I send it out to a company called Excalibur, which is now send it over to Walton and they do my recipe and pack it up so I have consistency in my blend. Okay. I'm about to Joe, stuff from Joe, Walton. I got a good friend. Uh, I, he got lots of money. I need to get him down here to buy me something out of get or something. Oh, once you have them, uh, I started out with selling five pounds. And I sold out in like 30 minutes because I had a free free shaking and I had a grill going and I sampled it and they were gone. And then we have turkey bacon. This is not the turkey bacon you get in your, your our competitor grocery store. This is made from 100% organic uh, boneless turkey thigh meat. Hmm. You, by looking at it, you can tell the difference. Are you making that yourself? No. And then um, our pork tenderloins and ribs are 1855, which is another all-natural uh, product. Our boneless pork is Beeler's, and then our bone-in pork is Chairman Reserve. And Chairman. I, That's I, some good stuff. Huh? I chose chose those because of the the size of the loin. <laughs> Uh, our customers just love it. I say you got a real beautiful shop here. Why don't you get a, another shot of this over through here? And then we support our community. Yeah. Well, you over, know, over here, if you notice, this barbecue sauce is made right here in Athens, Georgia. This is made right down the street in Struggleville in uh, Staten. What's the name the, of that one? Struggleville. I don't believe I've heard of that one. Uh, uh, a guy I named Charles Perry makes that. I got about 152 sauces And then in the Q sauce is made in Decula, Georgia. And actually the, the classic won the 2013 Flavor of Georgia Award last year. And this year the uh, mustard vinegar, the mustard barbecue sauce is up for uh, a club member, old Joe here, he's a member of the site, so if y'all ever around Winder, Georgia, drop in here and see him and he'll buy you a cup of coffee. No, our coffee's free every day for our cup. Oh, is it? We're like the old well, why did you tell me shop. I had to pay for that coffee all day? You <laughs> that's, tricked me. That's a, we're like the old time butcher shop. You sit and drink coffee, sit and see the bull, watch a little TV, 
Well, Joe, I'm glad you made it. Glad you remembered the cycle. Enjoy.